One of the things that we are going to start with today is gonna to be project management. Project management is one of the most important skills that you can build up in the kids because they can develop some time management skills, ability to identify benchmarks, ability to set good deadlines. We started off the year with Gantt charts, so we've talked a little bit about how we look at process, how we look at flow, and how we identify specific project benchmarks that are gonna help you to be successful. Today I'm gonna to give you new tools. So you guys just wanna sign up for that and go ahead and log in. If I manage 25, 30 different kids' projects, I'm gonna go crazy and I'm not gonna be able to handle it. So what I do is I teach my kids to manage their own projects. This stuff is essentially the same as the benchmarks that you set up. You wanna set specific deadlines on so that you know your project's moving forward. And high school kids tend to think very linearly. A Gantt chart helps them to identify what are a bunch of different things that I can be doing at the same time. You know how they have like categories? It's so like general categories to subcategories. They need an organized system to keep everything in the same place. You get a graphical representation timeline so that you can see when things are due, when you're supposed to be working on them, and what the appropriate deadlines are. So I can probably look into that when we do that next month or so. We have to figure out, okay, which way are we going to go? So we have to do charts to figure out which path makes the most sense for our goals. The next logical step would be to 3D model a frame and then print it out based on what yeah. we're trying to do. So like our next goal is just to get something that just flies so we can test all the electrical. Intertwined with engineering is project management and setting deadlines and creating goals for yourself, defining problems and solving them. This system is really nice because what it's doing is it's helping you track your project progress. When I put them in a position to become the expert, they can do that stuff and they can do it on their own and they don't need somebody telling them about it the whole time. Then it will actually remind you on email that you guys have some things to do. So what I figured out is that if I could get out of the way and support the students and allow them to work, right. we accomplished 10 times as much and it was a billion times better. And at the end of the day, what could be more valuable anyway that a kid can manage their own projects? Okay, good.